think there is some type of channel of sense between us. There is, there was, there is, there, there was, was, whatever. Yeah, I think there was. No, really, no, no senselessness. I, I, I was like, everything we ever said to each other was something we already knew. Somewhere, somehow, there was a sense and purpose and a great sensation of knowing. And even this feeling sometimes when I, I was looking at you, standing in front of me, looking you in the eyes. I had this feeling that you might be honestly hundreds of miles away from me, but somehow I could hear you and know you still. So I could see you in front of me like I was just making up this image of you and placing it two feet in front of me. So I could always look at you. You felt this way when I was in front of you. Not that I didn't appreciate your presence. I don't mean that. It's just that maybe I thought I, I didn't deserve it. So I had to convince myself I was just making you up. You always knew everything I was going to say. Or not that I, I was really making you up, but I, I just believe that I felt just this. Didn't you feel anything like what I'm describing? We were so connected. We were planted and rooted so close to each other, so far down that we always had that, that like feeling. Let's look at the sky. I can't see anything. I know. Can you see my memories? Now, wherever, whenever you are, can you see everything? That's what I want. I want to look at someone and already know them. Growing close to someone, seeing under their skin and then being ripped apart from them is too painful. The process of getting close to someone, I can't do it again. It takes too much. Do you know everything now? I only know what I knew before. I know you. Don't you think there's somewhere, some liminal space, somewhere with fresh grass and crisp air where we can sit on the hood of a car together? Now, really, and be together. Don't you think there's somewhere that could be real? That, 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 that could actually happen? I don't know anything. I don't think I ever did. No, 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 that's not right. There is a place. There's somewhere that, that I can look you in the eyes from miles away or for, for from her hundred years in the future and I can see you. There is. And I am going to find it. What do you mean? This is what we have. We, we Don't should've... say wasted time. Don't say that. Don't say we should have spent our time better than we had it. I spent every moment thinking about you. I don't need to hear it from you. I won't argue with you. I, I did feel sometimes, yeah, that I could understand what you meant before you even spoke. I knew I'd never need you to clarify what you meant or repeat something or explain to me because you were always so honest. You could whisper a single syllable and I'd see a world of meaning unravel. But we don't have that anymore. I'll find it. It? The place where we can be. Just you and me. Legs outstretched in the cold air. Forever. I used to stand in front of the mirror sometimes. Raise my arms up and down so I could see my skin glide over my ribs. Your hands would always blister in the cold. My teeth, no matter how much I brushed them. They were never quite white, always tended a little. My eyes would glaze over in movies. I can never keep focus. You used to tap your foot all the time, drove me crazy. To have a body. You used to. And you. Your hair always bounces when you walk. Like popcorn jumping away from your shoulders. 
Your hands move slowly, always. They never stop moving. Always tapping something or pointing somewhere and your eyes. You did it. I had to be with you. How do you feel? Alive. Mm -hmm.